Maui Cough Podcast is a no disqualifications, falls count anywhere, hair versus hair match, where the loser gets an extreme haircut. And entry first, the person at the table, your very own commentator, Mr. Chad Epic. There he is, Chad Epic. There he is. Boo. Boo. What, no music? No, yeah. You know what? I don't really care. First off, Mr. Labrie, it's greatness himself, the first father of greatness, Chad the Chameleon Epic. Shut your mouths. See, this might be my third legacy and my first one competing, but I guarantee what you see here is a beautiful head of hair that all of you soon to be, and obviously some of you already are, balding son of a bitches, never understand what it is to take care of hair like this. It takes time, it takes money, and it takes patience. You just start to uh, calm down. Uh-oh. Bucky will be back here before you can say... Blast off! Here he is, baby! Buck the Ross, the sexual Tyrannosaurus, air versus air. Look what he's got! He's got somebody's home! What the hell is that, Buck? It was somebody's home now. It looks like a bunch of weapons, baby. He's got a boombox. He's got a boombox out there. Hair versus hair match. Legacy 2010 Chad Epic and Buck DeRuss have been battling each other now for months. For months. And it's all coming down to this. Chad Epic putting his hair on. Look at him. Look at him run like a baby. Look at all the... Wow. Look at all the weapons Buck DeRuss bought out here. Second match of Legacy 2010. Wow, how many crutches does Buck have? Pete's counting, I think that's seven, and it's gonna be eight. Wow, look at that. There it is, and there's, here we go, match underway. Chameleon, Chad Epic, whatever you wanna call him, versus Buck, Del Ross, the sexual Tyrannosaurus. We've been waiting for this moment for months now. These two have been under each other's skin for so long. And listen to the crowd, capacity crowd here in the WAW Dojo, sold out, hottest ticket in town. And where's that music coming from? I think it's from the boombox. That's from uh, Buck Duress's boombox. So we got a little soundtrack here now to this match. Buck Duress rocking it like it's 1988 with the boombox coming out here inside the ring. Chad Epic on his knees in a very familiar place. Look, the best thing that could happen to Chad Epic is to lose this match. Buck Duress going for a suplex onto the crutches. Chad counters with punches to the face. We lost the soundtrack. What's up with that? Anyway. Chad's got Buck in that corner. Now Chad on the outside looking for something. He's got a box of paper. He's going to give him paper cuts. Oh no, he's got some, he's got some, oh, cookie sheets in the face. Those hurt, baby. You can bake some goodness or you can smash somebody's face in with those things. Multi What's that, a Nintendo? Man, people want Nintendos. What's up? Come on, no, man. Chad Epic just smashed a Nintendo to the face of Buck to Rust. This is hair versus hair, baby. If it was my hair, I would kill a man to prevent from my hair getting cut. And Chad Epic is willing to do the same thing. His afro, his Jew fro, his 1978 Barry Gibb look-alike haircut on the line versus the sexual hair of Buck to Rust. Both men on the outside, you see the ladders. Later on tonight, we will have a ladder match with a key hanging on top of the WAW ring for the rights of the managed Moody Star. But right now, hair versus hair. Chad Epic, Buck to Russ. Buck bringing Chad back into the ring. Here we go. Buck to Russ now looking for the leg drop right on the apron and he connects right with the chair on top. And the crowd, you can hear the crowd, baby. They're giving instructions to Buck to Russ. Match two into Legacy 2010. We saw Blood Fang win his match against Chinchilla. He's now 1-0 at Legacy in the Lumberjack match. Now we got hair versus hair. No rules. Look at that. Oh, choked him with the crutch and dragged him down like a bitch. We 
here. Buck going for a pin. One, two, three. Ooh, near pinfall there for Buck De Russ. Trying to save his hair and trying to cut Camillions. Listen up. Uh, I'm on Cami to lose. I'm on Chad to lose. But if he does lose, we're going to be here for a while. His hair could, like, hair all of, like, Eurasia. I'm talking Europe and Asia. Both combined, all right? He's got so much hair on him. But, uh... Buck Russ now working on Chad Epic, trying to bring him up to his feet. Oh, low blow by Chad Epic. A low blow by Chameleon, the man who calls himself. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing, man? Shut up. Man, you taking your medication? He's taking. Oh, wait. Hey, hey. Don't be doing that, man. Come on. Buck Russ, better watch out. But no. Oldest trick in the book, baby. That is salt in the eyes of Buck Russ. And salt don't feel good, especially when it comes to Chad Epic's hands. Because it's extra salty, because his hands are salty. Look at that kendo stick now. On to the back, both these men. What's he got there? It's tape. We got plenty of matches for you tonight, ladies and gentlemen. We've got two Hall of Famers going for the presidency, Sin and the Jersey Devil. We've got Falcon and Staples for the pure title. We've got the Lumberyard Legacy Championship match. We also got the team match and, of course, our main event. Captain Vincent Torello and Rocco will fight. This crowd chanting for Buck. Oh, right to the face. You can smell the substance that Chad Epic used to blind Buck Russ. Smells like he used it before he got here in the bathroom alone with some underage magazines. He doesn't get porno. He gets 17. Here we go for a pin. One, two. That, oh, that's a two. That's a two. Buck Russ's hair is saved with a two count on the outside. Oh, DDT on the outside. DDT by Chad Epic. And another pin. One, two. Oh, come on, Chad. Look at the Chad is making a mistake. This is why Chad is a moron. All that Italian greasy substance he uses has gone to his brain. He's got the IQ. He doesn't even, I don't even think he has IQ. Makes George Bush look smart. Inside of the ring. Buck's got that carriage, that supermarket. Oh, look at that, a legacy t-shirt that he stole from a fan, probably. And he gave a fan his hoodie, or his t-shirt. I wouldn't want that. And now the fan's wiping his ass with it, very nice. This is Legacy 2010, Chad Epic, Buck to Ross, hair versus hair. And oh, and he misses with the spear, goes right into the carriage, face first, Chad Epic. And here we go, Buck getting the upper hand with the crutch, weapons all around. Buck to Ross, now he's got that trash can, that trash can, what's he going to do? Oh, oh, he puts it right on top of Chad Epic. Here we go, what's up, what's Buck did it? Oh, kick to the side there. And now he's got, oh, brutal. Oh my God, three, five, five times, five times with the crutch and there's more. Brutally beating Chad Epic to a pump. I think I, there's no way Chad Epic's gonna be able to commentate after this match. That's gonna be dealer solo, baby. All alone in Legacy 2010, painting it black in the WAW Dojo. Now he's got, what's he got, duct tape? What the hell is he going to do, duct tape? Oh my God. Chad's a hairy man. Anywhere you put duct tape, it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt. Oh man, is he duct taping his hands? Around his, his neck? Oh my god, this is like Saw 2 kind of stuff. That was like hostile. Like Eli Roth directing this match right here. And now he's got submission move. A submission move on Chad Epic of some sort. A submission move that he doesn't have to do anything with. Oh, right in the face. And Chad, uh, Chad, shut up, man. Just give up, Chad. Give up, Chad. Tap out, baby. Just give up. It's just hair. It grows back. You don't get your ass punked out. Oh, damn. Damn it, damn it, damn. 
And here we go. Chat, Epic inside that carriage. Oh, applying pressure to the back. And it's a mission move. Chat, Epic, Mike Tell. Chat, Epic, tap out. Chat, Epic, it's tapped out. Chat, Epic. The winner. Bakhtaros. Bakhtaros gives his hair. Chat, Epic, must shave the fro. Chad Epic has lost his hair! And the duct tape is wrapped around! And listen to the crowd! Shave his head! Where, the fuck? Where did Chad... Chad Epic must have hit, hit it. Is it in that box right there? Look at that box. We're looking for the... It's not in here. Where did Chad Epic do with it, baby? Where'd you put it, Chad? Hold on, I'll get the ball on this. Chad! This is live commentary, baby, so all you can hear. This is Chad Epic, the 70s man. Where'd you put him, Chad? Chad Epic is a weasel because he hid the razors. Here we go, Buck. We got him. Finally, couldn't escape it, baby. Couldn't escape it. There it is. Now, this is Chad Epic acting like a little girl. He's going to miss his big, big Jufro. Chad Epic is going to lose 50 pounds tonight by losing his hair. Give it up for Buck to us. It's like a, it's like pubic hair, a burlo pad, and I don't, oh, there it is, there it is, hair is coming out. Oh, that's long too, so that hurts with the razor. Chad Epic cutting his hair, baby. Hold on, baby. Do you need to cut some? I'm gonna come in and help Dr. Ross.